Thank you, Irena. For Eddie Rowland, talking to the media goes with the job. He serves as Monroe County District 2 Commissioner, and he's no stranger to reporters. But tonight, he's giving an interview unlike any he's ever done. He's asking for help finding his brother who disappeared under mysterious circumstances. We have spent hundreds of man hours scouring areas in Macon to try to find him, and his friends and his family are extremely worried about him. 55-year-old Richard Rowland came to Macon from his North Carolina home because he needed to push a reset on his life. He's been having some, some uh, mental issues, just some, uh, some mental problems. Anyway, he came down here and uh, about three weeks ago, and then uh, about 10 days ago, he just disappeared. Just disappeared after Bibb County deputies say he was last spotted, leaving the Extended Stay Hotel on Riverside Drive in his pickup truck with D'Angelo Davis riding with him. The deputies say that Davis returned later the same day without Roland, but continued to use Roland's truck for days. That's why deputies say that Davis has been arrested and charged with felony theft. He said that my brother just got out of the vehicle and left and left his vehicle with this guy, but, but that's that the, the story's not adding up. But one huge concern that adds to the Roland family's endless worry is what they say they learned about Davis's background. He was arrested for murder in 2017, I think it was. Um, he was, uh, he pled out to a lesser charge and he was in prison and he was let out in January of this year. The heartbreak just overwhelms Roland's mother. We do miss him and we love him. But until they hear otherwise, the family continues to hold out hope and continues to search.